Good evening. Uh, good afternoon. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Hey. The last video I think I did properly was I think 10 days ago. I was alive and uh, had gone visiting. Uh, so I did a live because I hadn't done so many videos quite for quite a while. So went visiting. Um, I had to go and help uh, help out somebody who's you know a family member that will come again. It's another story. I had to come, again. but then it became unwell. So like I've been so clogged up. I don't know if you can hear me, and I could not do anything at all. I was literally, I was literally poorly. Um, so from the day I visited, from the day after I posted my live. I became unwell, pushed on for about one day or two, and then, oh my goodness me, people, my whole skin was hurting, everything. And I initially thought it was going to be it's malaria, it wasn't, it was the flu, but, uh, praise be to God, hallelujah. You know, sometimes you get friends who are not friends they are like sisters so within this period um i've been talking about i was telling them i was unwell and everything uh and one of them was too far she goes please if you become you know she's, she's about uh, eight miles away eight is eight zero so she's past massacre so she goes if you become unwell let me know i'll come and pick you and you come and stay with my come and stay with me and my family. And I'm like, listen to you. You're working, you've got family and everything. And you want me to come and disturb you? And of course I'll come with my blessed son. <laughs> you got a tissue. Excuse me. <laughs> anyway. So of course that was a no-no. Then the other one, but she was like, do this, do this, which was lovely. And she kept telling me, and what one of the things she told me to use, the other things I couldn't manage to get them. But the other thing, the thing she told me to use was to have a flannel and put on my face. Initially, I thought the flannel was to, like you dip it in cold water, but my, my, my head was hurting so much. And my nose was so blocked. So I'm telling her, no, 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 no. I know what I'm going to do. So I went and got flannel and put it in hot water. Not like hot. Then I kept putting it on my face and oh my goodness, it did relieve me. So it would relieve me for about half an hour and I would doze off. Then of course I'd get clogged again, wake, wake up, use the flannel. So throughout the day, Jim, I kept giving me the flannel. And then uh, at night, I kept getting up myself. So at least that night I slept a bit. Now of course by morning I was so tired because I was getting up. So the following day, um, the other friend, when I spoke to them, said, no, 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 we're going to have to come to you. I'm like, no, no, don't worry, don't worry. Then another one when I told her, she went from work, from her work, went to the market, bought food, went to her house, cooked the food, because she would catch the cold, cooked the food, came and knocked the door, and dropped the food by the door. Jeremiah just picked up the food and gave it to me. Because <laughs> she was like, oh. And and I had something small for her and I literally dipped it in, <laughs> dropped it in the, almost like a COVID time. But I can understand. She didn't want to catch anything and it really, I don't want anybody to catch this. Yeah, so that's what happened. And uh, we, oh, it's going to come up. So yeah, so that's what has been happening. That's why I've been posting my people. That's why I've been away and quite and and, and and well. And I'm gonna show you what this person bought for me. Oh my goodness me, what can I do? Thank her. And the chicken that she bought for me, Ugandan chicken, you know what I mean, guys? The pineapple, all those things behind she bought for me. Guys, I just want to let you know that I didn't have even enough energy to peel some of the fruits, but anyway, she got me that. And I'm sounding 
like this but i was so unwell and guess what she got me chicken of course you know our local chicken she boiled it and put in those potatoes people call them irish potatoes over monday and and peeled the healthiest potatoes oh my goodness me just wanted to see what you bought for me so i'm here showing him and then you know i think biscuits <laughs> um yeah Gemma was happy the vitamin c look at that um that really helps me what's one does she had gold that should come with that and um you know with literally the fruits what can i say um that max strength is what literally did the job the moment i took it that night after eating i took it it really 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 worked uh, wonders i felt better haven't looked back since even a little bit of weakness just lots of drinking and i'm better thank you my sister thank you how can i thank you enough <laughs> so my thought was i saying so that friend of mine got me fruits and vegetable soup and that really did the wonder so i'm just so grateful then i'm grateful for another friend i was like oh i'm so well and she just sent me some money so they just said oh mommy you've got good friends i said no they're not friends they're sisters and i call them sisters because a sister is somebody like i don't know if i've already said it but if i have i'll repeat myself I say, I repeat myself, I repeat myself, I repeat myself. A sister is somebody, doesn't have to be blood, who knows you're struggling and they come in emotionally, physically, spiritually, financially. Uh, physically, I think I've said it. That's a sister. Somebody who might tell I'm not well. And they say, oh, I hope you're okay. And that's it. They don't pray. They don't do anything. Hang on a minute. What's a sister? That's a stranger. So, yeah, that's who I am. And that's, to me, that's good news. I wouldn't consider that, um, yes, it's been an illness, but it's come up with some good news. It's just come to show me this is what life is about. Yeah. So I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful. I want to be grateful. I want to be grateful for the big and the small, for the small things. So I'm grateful for that. Hopefully, not hopefully, I'm grateful. So I am on the mend. And being that I'm on the mend, uh, more is going to come. I was doing the plumbing. Plumbing is going on. Um, videos are coming up for the plumbing and um, yeah <laughs> keep tuned so plumbing is coming up in actual sense the thing with the with the plumbing um it now this video has come from <laughs> being well and being gifted to plumbing i'll just leave it there but plumbing is coming up i'm still plumbing i'm still finishing on the plumbing and uh, some other departments especially in the compound in the house with myself you know we keep on day by day um oh dear lord um this is this i love that song day by day dear lord especially in these days it's just go day by day and be grateful for everything so i'm grateful i'm grateful i'm well i'm grateful for all the small and big things that we're receiving i'm grateful so i'll see you in the next one which won't be long hopefully in jesus name in jesus name it will not be long otherwise that's it really hopefully i'll do another live soon <laughs> come on lane so yes so my people that's about it honestly thanks a lot for watching thanks for encouraging me thanks for the support for checking on me those who've been checking on me thank you and to all the subscribers what can i say thank you blessings and blessings thank you for being part of our thank you for being part of the family if anyone is watching and they're not yet subscribed think about subscribing please um hit the like button put on the notification bell 
and share if you can. Please, if you can kindly help and watch until the end and do not skip the advice because that is, gives me a little bit of income. Okay, thank you. Take care. Blessings. Bye for now.